Welcome brothers and sisters, welcome to a new video of Triple Grace. My name is Michael, I am the founder of Triple Grace and the Righteous Path Movement Foundation. And the topic of this video is the shift, changes in the warriors. Brothers and sisters, I believe that some of you who have given me reports about your situation right now do not understand fully what God is doing in your life. I will give you an example. Before someone who has let his health degrade for a long time, before he becomes strong again, the first thing what will happen is when he starts to make exercise, when he starts to maybe going running, when he starts to go on an exercise bike or something like this, first he feels very weak. That is because the body is emptying out of all the toxins that are there. The body that is not understanding after all this time of quiet, now there is some action and that makes him first weak. But that is only for a short period of time. Once that weakness is over, the body catches on and he becomes stronger by the day. Therefore, brothers and sisters, keep calm. God will shift in your favor. The same for a butterfly. First, he will become very weak, almost dying in the state where he become a cocoon. And then inside the cocoon, it becomes stronger and stronger and stronger. And when it then really opens up, that wonderful, beautiful butterfly will emerge. It's a time of shifting. And it is no wonder that just over the weekend, in my closet, I found a very beautiful butterfly as a sign that the change has started, as a sign that we will all emerge so beautifully. God will make us all new and the changes are there. Some of you are already past this week, week period, uh, phase and they are starting to get stronger. Others are shining with the light and others are still weak and say, Oh, I'm so weak, I will not make it. Oh, yes, you will. The world will be taken out of you and so very soon you are part of the kingdom and part of New Zion. This must happen just before the portal opens. I have told you that the, that the Lord will empty you out so that he can fill you with a new. And that will bring weakness to your body. Because your body is used to the world, to this comfort, to all this, but everything will change now and you need strength. And that will come through weakness. Weakness first then strength will be built up. So, brothers and sisters, when you experience either suddenly heat strokes on your body, suddenly weakness, suddenly this, and you don't know what is going on, then know and understand that the Lord is working in your favor. He is shifting you. As he is shifting a butterfly from a caterpillar to this wonderful creation that he has made. You will come out as a new being, as a new person, as a son of God. Let all the weaknesses disappear from our body. Give us the strength, Lord, so that we can stand for your kingdom. No one will succumb to this weakness. Everyone will be strengthened. It might take a bit of time, a little bit of time, because we are all comfort creatures and we have all slept for too long and slumbered for too long. But now we are waking up and we become strong again and we will be standing for the kingdom in the will of the Father as he has always predestined us. And this will begin with a weak period. For me the same. There are days when I'm full of power and everything. Then there are days when I'm weak. I understand that all this of the world has to come out, and it will. When the portal opens, we will all be ready to be taken into our destiny and purpose. When the portal opens, the Lord will have emptied us out, and the light that will come through his mighty hand, that will come through the portal, will then fill us within you. 
And from that moment forward, we will walk as his two ambassadors and two sons and daughters here on earth, powerfully for the Lord. And we will seek the lost sheep and we will take them home with the full strength of the kingdom of heaven. So rejoice in your weakness, rejoice, because the Lord is changing you. For some of you, he is guiding you to repentance. For some of you, he is showing you sins that were committed in the past so that you will not repeat them if you are going in the missions back into that time frame. All is done because God is shifting you in your favor. You have asked him, you have volunteered to be part of it. Now God will do his part so that you have the strength to do it. Therefore, brothers and sisters, keep calm. The changes are here and almost everyone is feeling it. I hear the reports and see the comments in the pin, in, in, under the videos. I see them all where people say, oh, I feel so weak. Yes, you feel so weak because the world is removed by force right now out of you. And then you become strong, strong for the kingdom to stand, to speak and to stand before authorities and kings, to be a king and priest for the kingdom of heaven, for the heavenly kingdom, a true ambassador with full strength. Brothers and sisters, understand that this is a time of transition. And when a body transitions from a lazy old body to an active, full of strength body, then all this starts with weakness first. And then it will become stronger and stronger and stronger. Let us all wait for the end result that will be a strong and powerful warrior in a strong and powerful remnant army of New Zion. Keep calm. God will shift in your favor. Brothers and sisters, be blessed in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen and Amen. Maranatha.